engaging the enemy. Target clear. Enemy aircraft has been shot down. One step closer to our dream. There you all are. Hey, help. What's up? I have good news. It must be super duper good news. You're grinning from ear to ear. If I didn't know any better, I'd say we were going up to the sea. That's it. Huh? What? We've received an official order to go up to the ocean. The day has finally come to show the world what Aegis can do. Uh... Anchor, I hate to say this, but I think Helm has finally lost her marbles. I was thinking the same thing. Do you think it was because she was never able to go up to the sea? What a shame. Ugh. Of you two. Where is Deputy Chief Burning Gum right now? Hmm. She's definitely as uptight as she's always been. Anyway, I would assume he'd be in his office like always. Then let's go. Follow me. Huh? Can you at least give us some more information? Away we go. Do, do, do. Oh. Who is it? Deputy Chief Burning Gum? It's Helm. Oh, Helm. Oh, come in. I apologize for showing up unannounced. It's okay. If it's you, th there must be a viable reason. So, what is it? We're going on a mission to investigate the ocean up on the surface. Wait, she was actually telling the truth back there? I guess so. I'm officially requesting permission to use the Admire. In, in investigating the ocean on the surface? This is the first I've heard of this. I was just briefed on the mission myself. A strange signal was caught on the sea, so we're being sent to search the surrounding area. The mission itself is simple. But as a precaution, my hope was that the Admire could be sent up to the surface as well. Hmm. I'm sorry, but that's impossible. But... how? We have a boat party scheduled a w w week from now. The preparations are already com com complete. Mast and Anchor are w working on the final touches. So that's why the two of them were on the Admire. Yeah. Besides, d d deploying the Admire for such a banal task would be more trouble than it's worth. But this is the first time we've received a sea-based mission. We don't know what unexpected events might take place. The Admire should make an appearance and prove its worth. And what if it doesn't? What would you do then? The entire reason we're holding this party is because we can barely afford the maintenance fees. What if we go out of our way to send the Admire out on the water and nothing happens? Would you be willing to take res responsibility for that? Uh. From what I'm he he hearing, you're talking about the signal that we captured last time. It sounds to me like this is nothing more than an ex ex excuse to horse around on the high seas. The upcoming party is far more important than that. You know as well as I do that marine-based raptures exist, lying dormant on the ocean floor. We're dealing with a lot of uncertainties here. We don't know when or for what reason they may awaken. There haven't been any sightings in decades. Th that's... Ahem. <clears throat> it's not that I, I... I don't understand how you feel. But you must consider this f f from my perspective. Okay. I asked for too much. I apologize. I'll excuse myself. Helm. Helm. <sighs> Let's go. 
You can always count on quality training. Enemy aircraft has been shot down. Closer to our dream. Dang, I'm good. There's still one week left to the boat party, and we already finished all the preparation. I didn't think it was possible, but we're getting better at this. This whole ship is spick and span from stem to stern. All with seven whole days left until the party. Incredible, right? Hmm. Right. I'm impressed with you two. Good job, both of you. Aye aye, Captain! So don't you worry, Helm. Go ahead. What? What do you mean? The party is one week away! I don't know the exact mission schedule, but you should be setting out within the next few days. So I'm telling you not to worry, and to go take up this mission. Oh. The Aegis Squad has never been deployed to the sea before. Who knows when we'll get another opportunity like this? I want you guys to experience the sea as much as you can. So, Mast and Anchor, I want you two to go on the mission. Are you sure you can take care of everything here? You've got to verify each of the guests' entry tickets, replenish the food and drinks the second they run out, not to mention all the cleaning up after the party. All the rooms the guests stayed in need to be sorted up before the next guest arrives as well. And the list goes on. Will you be okay? Um, I'll just have to do my best. Figures. You're typically cool as a cucumber under pressure, but when it comes to this kind of thing, you fold faster than a house of cards. Then again, I suppose that's all part of your charm. Anyway, you said this was an official mission? Right. If there's a first, then there's bound to be a second. Hmm. You never know. This may be a golden opportunity. Sea-based missions may increase. So, Helm, you will be a nice pin on our collective lapel. We'll boast about that time Helm sailed the high seas. We can tell them that it won't be long until the Admire will be called into action. If we say stuff like that, I'm sure donations will come flooding in. Yeah, like a big old tidal wave. Leave the party to us. You just focus on coming back safely. I'm certain that next time, the entire Aegis Squad will be there. All of us. Oh. Very well. I'll do my best to make you both proud. I'll prove that I'm capable on the field, to ensure that we're given other missions. Aye aye, Captain. Be safe. I will. Counters, all set. All set. All set. Seraphim is all set as well. Don't forget about me. All set. I will be the sole representative for the Aegis Squad. Really? That's a shame. I was hoping that the whole Aegis Squad could go up to the sea together. Same here. This mission was tailor-made for them. The boat party threw a wrench in our plans. There was nothing we could do. Dang, that's too bad. Ocean, here we come! You're certainly chomping at the bit, Anise. How could I not? Last time, I got stranded ashore. I've had to put up with you guys talking endlessly about how much fun you've had on the island. I've been green with envy. I'll show you all the best spots from last time. Sounds good! Go... Slip Freema, I made you a special hammock for the occasion. Oh dear, what have you got in store for us this time, Jan? Sorry, but I'm afraid that's a secret. I'll let you know once we're on the island. Ooh, I can't wait. Oh, everybody seems so carefree. I suppose you're right. Let's go. 
Initiating engagement sequence. Step closer to our dreams. 